Good morning, Richland High School. Thank you for viewing Ram TV. Dismissal times for today are as follows. 2 o'clock, junior high and varsity, boys and girls cross country. 2.15, junior high boys soccer. 2.45, junior high girls. Our pack, the Richland High School Performing Arts will be holding auditions for the fall's play, The Importance of Being Earnest. Students in, grade ni in grades 9 through 12 interested should be pick up an invitation to audition outside the technology office. Art club, any student enrolled in art or class, crafts class for the 2013-2014 school year is eligible to sign up for the Fine Arts Disney trip, scheduled for April 2014. Please see Mrs. Ringler before today for trip and fundraising information. Congratulations, girls JV and varsity soccer. Holding their 2-1 win last night against Central Camera, the girls gave up a goal 40 seconds into the game, but freshman Emily Hill even the score later in the first half, and senior Bree Myers netted the game winner in the second. Freshman Allison Patola had an assist. Senior Sam Hauser had her first varsity win in, winning goal. The varsity record is now win, one win and zero losses. The JV started, started their season tied 3-3. Sammy Felton had two goals, and Tina Rizza added a goal. Next game is tomorrow at home, 6.30, varsity only. Good luck, girls. Junior High Volleyball Open Gym. Junior High Volleyball will have open gym on Fridays from 3 o'clock to 4.30 in the main gym. Freshman and sophomore class. There will be a meeting on Friday, September 6th, during period 6 in room C105. For any student in 9th and 10th grade interested in running for a class office or executive board position. If any questions, please see Mrs. Gruss. College Fair for Juniors and Seniors. Permission slips to attend the college fair on September 17th are due in the guidance office by Friday, September 13th. Tennis. The Richmond girls tennis team broke in win column yesterday with the victory over Greater Johnstown by a score of 5-0. to zero. Strong, for, strong performance was delivered by Selena Moran and Christy Tang, who each scored, each oh scored second victories of the season. Earning their first win, Kaylee Andrews in singles and doubles teams Dana Graham, Alyssa Klein, and Nikki Patel, and Molly Hunter. Next up is Bedford today at home. Good luck. Sad. There will be sad sign-ups starting Monday through Thursday in the cafeteria during lunch. Any student engaged in grades 9 through 12 who are interested in joining Students Against Destructive Decisions may sign up. Also, any student in grades 10 through 12 interested in joining Drug Free may sign up at this time also. Junior, Senior, Class Officer, and Executive Board Election Forms. Petition packets are now avail 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 <laughs> available in the office for students who are interested in becoming a junior or senior class officer or a member in the executive board. Petitions must be returned to the guidance office no later than noon on Wednesday, September 11th. Happy birthday to John Shirt. Happy birthday. Hope you have a nice day. And now here's a note from Siri. The Pirates narrowly defeated the Brewers by a score of 4-3 to three yesterday. Steve Phillip, a new student here at Richland. So, Steve, what's your favorite part of Richland? The football team's better than before. And what school did you come here from? St. Benedict's. This is Sarah Latosky, the new student. Sarah, how do you like Richland? I like it a lot. Do you like the people here? Yeah, they're nice. That's so, I'm standing here with Miss Eva. Miss Eva, how do you okay. like being back at Richland? I actually really never left. I was on an absence uh, last year, but I still felt close at home to everybody with all their support and everything, with everything that our family was going through. So it's good to actually be physically back in the halls, but I really felt that I left. I always felt that, you know, I had everybody's support, and I can't thank you enough for everything you did for me, both the faculty and administration and students throughout last year. So it's very nice to be back in the halls. Thanks, Miss Eva. I'm here with Olivia for the question of the day. So, what is the best piece of advice you've ever gotten in your life? Always to be yourself and never copy others. Keep it classy, Richard. <laughs> <laughs>